Hi, I'm Josh Fralick, member of JP Shooting Team, and today we're going to spend a little bit of time uh, running over the configuration of my rifles. So I started shooting competitively about three, three and a half years ago. Been shooting three gun two years, and been shooting PCC about a year now. Um, throughout that time, I put in uh, about a half hour a day, every single day, in dry fire and, and live fire training. I've shot you know, hundreds of matches throughout that time and um, I've come to find that I'm pretty particular about the equipment that I use and how I use it. So today we're going to spend some time on the configuration of, of my rifles. Um, you'll notice as we go through, I, I'm, I'm running open division um, and so you'll see multiple optics on some of the guns and I've, I want to get the most out of my equipment. Um, in open division, that's critical, just like any other division for that matter. But um, we're going to talk a little bit about why I put what I put on my rifles. Um, all right, let's take a minute to dig in and take a look at the GMR rifle that I'm running for pistol caliber carving. Starting at the front, I'm running the three port JP competition uh, muzzle brake. Helps me to keep that muzzle so nice and flat when I'm running the gun fast on the stages. Uh, rapid configuration handguard's got good grip on it, nice diameter. So I can really get a grip, hold on to the gun, my hand doesn't slip around, and uh, again, stay on target. Thermal dissipator on the gun and the JP Supermatch Barrel, which allows me to shoot nice tight groups, even out to like 100 yards, which is uh, pretty solid uh, on a 9mm when I can ring little plates all day long. Running a dual charging side, side charging upper on this gun, which is nice when you're doing unloaded starts or you need to rack the gun if you're in a prone position or something like that. It allows you to keep your hand away from your face, rack the gun, manipulate the gun as you need to. And then uh, I'm running JP Easy Trigger in this gun, which is a nice, crisp, light break, instant reset. Uh, run that along with the JP 9mm bolt and uh, silent capture spring on this gun. Running the same grip, same stock that I run on my 223, just to keep the guns as similar as possible so that um, when I pick up one of my JP rifles, they all feel the same. I run the JP offset mount and uh, a couple of reflex dots on here. Um, allows me to stay in position, stay on target. This whole package just lets me shoot fast and do my job on the, on the stage. So that's the JP GMR rifle, how I've got it configured and why. All right, let's take a minute and we'll dig through on how I've got my 223 rifle for three gun set up. I run the JP PSC 11 and uh, it's a 16 inch gun. Um, I'm running that three port competition muzzle brake just like I do on the GMR 13. Um, that brake along with the adjustable gas block from JP and the ultra low mass bolt carrier group packaged with the silent capture spring just keeps this gun shooting flat. Um, really, really flat shooting gun, really soft shooting gun. Uh, I run the Light Contour Super Match Barrel with a thermal dissipator um, underneath the Rapid Configuration Handguard. And you'll notice that I'm running Rapid Configuration Handguard on both my GMR, my PSC 11, and on my Dissident Arm Shotgun. So Dissident custom fit a Rapid Configuration Handguard and use the same grip that I'm used to on my JP rifles so that when I get behind the gun, I'm comfortable. It's the same grip on all three guns. So it's just, I'm at home when I'm behind the gun. Nothing new, same grip, same feel. The PSC 11 gun has a uh, side charger on it. So it's a dual charging upper. Um, I run a PRS stock on both of these guns. Again, just so that I get the, the same nice feel behind the guns. I like to keep them the same. And then uh, I'm running, uh, Razor offset mount, um, JP offset mount with a razor on it, and a razor 1x6 Vortex scope on this gun so that I can see what I'm shooting at. Um, I'm also running microfit pins to keep the receiver as tight as possible. Again, this is Josh Fralick, JP Shooting Team. Today we ran over the uh, configuration of my rifles. Um, check out some of the rest of our videos on our YouTube channel, and remember to subscribe and uh, click notifications.